Okay, well I'm starting the uh, fiberglass portion. The, uh, the caulk is uh, basically dried. Uh, I put one piece down here to kind of see how it goes in there before I film the other part. Um, I'm just kind of leaving maybe a, an inch around the edges here. Uh, this stuff's kind of a little stretchy. It kind of like separates the fibers separate a little bit when you need to stretch it in there. Uh, it's kind of a little odd over in this corner here. Um, of course, I've never fiberglass before, so I'm just kind of figuring this out. Um, so, and uh, let me uh, do the next side here. It's not quite en wide enough to uh, to do all the way, so I'm probably gonna have to put another piece in the middle here. So leave about two inches there, and then when I scoot it in, kind of creeps a little bit. So just tuck this in the corner here. Move it a little bit. Just kind of push it back in the corners there. So you just have to kind of work it in there. Try not to have any bumps, I guess. So I'm not gonna drain very well if there's a bunch of bumps, probably. So. It's a little easier in this corner over here because it's not as deep as over there. So. I guess it's the easiest thing is to kind of work your way this way. If you do it here and then do it here, it's just going to pull it this way. So you got to make sure to tuck it in this way. as many of the bumps out as possible. I'm sure some of that will kind of work out once you put the, uh, the resin in. should just about do it for the uh, the fiberglass cloth. Uh, now I just need to uh, to mix up the resin and uh, put the uh, put the hardener in there and uh, start working it in. I got the uh, Some cheap paint brushes and uh, spatula, plastic spatula uh, for that. So, All right. Okay, so I'm gonna do the uh, the resin, and uh, Oliver here is gonna help me. And uh, 
All right, uh, I'm supposed to mix half of this with half of this. And I'm just using a three inch, a cheap three inch brush and uh, one of these cheap plastic mixing things. I think it's like two dollars or something. Um, the light might not be as good because I got the door open for the fresh air. So mixed with the, the shop light, so. All right. I'm hard to tell what's about half. <laughs> in half the hardener so you got to puncture the hardener Mix it up here. No, Oliver. Let's go outside. I'll turn the exhaust fan on. Okay. So I'll start over back in this far corner over here.
Okay, well it didn't turn out exactly perfect, but uh, should work. The, uh, I think the humidity is uh, too high and it's or too low and it's too hot. So I'll try it out. And see, I guess worst case, I could just put another coat on it. Okay, the epoxy is all dried now. Uh, now I'm just going to go around and uh, cut the, uh, the excess off around here. <laughs> 